Hi everyone, I'm Melissa Dunan in Sky Canyon in Ward 6. Today I'm going to take you inside of a local coffee house that's not in a commercial property. This one's inside a community center. It's called Aspire Coffee House and it is good. Let's go inside. It's pretty safe to say your next coffee addiction will be to this place. Tucked away in an unconventional spot in Sky Canyon, you'll find this sip of heaven. Meet Lindsay and Mandy, best friends since high school, who ventured into business together. Both of them coffee lovers, but Lindsay's background in nutrition gave them an idea. We make all of our own syrups and we kind of wanted, kind of like aspired to be healthy. We. So we did a healthier take on coffee. Everything from snickerdoodle to pumpkin is natural. They don't use any refined sugar. And this way it's just easily metabolized. We usually use maple syrup or honey. So it's kind of like natural sweeteners. We've tested them so much and we've had taste testing with all of our friends and we just made it to where they, you can't even taste it. So you still feel like you're drinking uh, just a regular coffee, but it is, and it's a lot healthier. And your focus stays on the flavor of the coffee. <laughs> Lindsay and Mandy have only been in the Northwest space for a few months. They actually started as a food truck right outside what's now their shop. We would park in the front parking lot and we would be there as often as we possibly could. So as soon as we kind of saw it, we, we snooped and we looked in and we were like, oh my gosh, look how cute this is. <laughs> so that was like a big thing. So we just kind of just stayed on them and we were very persistent. That persistence paid off and landed them inside of Sky Canyon's community center. I think it's a really good idea, especially to help out smaller businesses, kind of give them another option instead of getting the higher rent with the bigger space. and. Like I said, it kind of brings in more of the community feel when it's part of something else. It's the perfect neighborhood coffee house, but coffee is just a portion of the menu. Everyone's also talking about the food. We work with a local bakery, or actually a couple, and it's 5098 bread, and they make this amazing artisan bread. So we have a couple toasts on our menu. We do an avocado toast and a caprese toast with the house made yes. pesto that's also vegan. We do the banana, banana almond, almond butter. butter and a house made hazelnut spread, so it's similar to Nutella, but it doesn't have all of the sugar in it. And then that's topped with strawberries and honey drizzle. And you can't forget about their pastries, some of which they make in house, but others they sell from a local bakery. Everything from vegan, gluten free to keto options, you can find it here. The duo felt strongly about supporting other small businesses in their venture, which is why you'll find products from other local businesses lining their shelves. Aspire Coffee House has gotten a lot of attention. Their coffee is delicious, the food's amazing, and this Instagram-inspired wall is the perfect spot for guests to snap a few pictures and get their name out there. And that was a big thing for us. With the trailer, our trailer was extremely Instagram-worthy, and so we wanted to bring as much of that into this space as we possibly could. And like, she was like, oh my gosh, we need to have an Instagram wall. I was like, yes, so that's like our little area. So like just everything, we tried to like, everybody calls this the trailer 2.0 or whatever it is, because it is, it's like, the more people can take pictures and get your name out there, the more marketing you get, you know? So it does help a small business, especially during the, these times. The hope is to keep growing one community at a time. All right, everyone, well, I'm gonna go ahead and give these two a try because it would be rude if I didn't, right? All right, that's gonna do it for us. Remember, if you wanna open up a business in the city of Las Vegas, you're urged to call our Economic and Urban Development Department at 702-229-6551. I got my pumpkin vanilla latte, my toast. I'm good to go. See you next time.